Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for January 10th. This is for whoever it resonates with. January 10th. Just going to see whatever comes up. Now, I just wanted to let you know that I just got done doing a three month forecast for the elements. So, for fire signs, air signs, water signs, and earth signs, three month forecast. It's downloading. The last one is downloading now. It should be released within the next hour. So you can go and check for that. I will have a playlist on my home page of the three-month forecasts from the moment you watch it. So from the day you watch it, three months out. This Now I'm doing the daily vibe for January 10th. January 10th. What do we have for January 10th for, for all signs? Thursday, January 10th. Keep in mind that not every video is meant for you. Some are, some aren't. Ten of Swords. Whew. Really, it's the end of a difficult time. It's a completion. Something is coming to an end. Something that was really painful. It's coming to an end. It is. It's coming to an end. It's a completion of something that was really, really painful. Something that you may have tried to hide from or something that you held on to. You may have held on to this pain. It's what you know, right? This could have been an obsession of some sort. You may have held on to some, something, some sort of obsession. I'll, z I'll zoom this camera in when I'm done. The star reversed. Given up hope. I've given up hope. There's no, there's no hope left. You may have been obs obsessed with something. You're finally letting it go. That you realize there's no hope. There's no wish fulfillment there. The tower reversed. You can't avoid the truth any longer. You may try. You may have tried to avoid this truth for a long time. Obsessed, obsessed. You can't avoid it. You can't avoid it. Unavoidable. You may you may have delayed for as long as you possibly could, but if it's a false foundation, it's a false foundation. I mean, you can't you can't fix it. If it's not meant to be. It's not meant to be. Three of coins. Learning new things. Appreciating. Accepting, accepting the lesson. That's what's happening here. Somebody ex is accepting the lesson that this betrayal, this pain has caused them, that they've been obsessed with. I'm accepting it. Somebody's accepting it. I'm, I'll take it. I'll, I'll, it is what it is, right? It is what it is. Now, this is also a card of working together, putting in effort to do your share, more than your share. I mean, it looks like somebody has put in effort to do more than their share. You've held on, holding on to more than you should have anyway. That's what's been happening here. You've held on to more than you should have. Or somebody did. Some and now we have somebody that is has got a new vision, right? Stepping in, stepping into the unknown. This person is. This person is like breaking a barrier. It looks like somebody has found uh, the strength that they need to go where they need to go. This 
somebody is finding the strength to move in a new direction, that's for damn sure. This guy's going someplace that he's never been before. Seeing the light. Somebody is seeing the light. Taking the power in their own hands. Right now. The time is now. For me to come out of hiding and release this obsession. To stop holding on to this pain. Somebody is taking the power in their own hands. Completion. Major completion. There's no wish fulfillment here. There's no hope left. There's I can't can't stay here. I have to complete this cycle. It's over, it's done. I accept the lesson. That's the truth. The lesson this is this is the truth. Somebody is accepting the lesson and taking their power back. When they've been try they've been obsessed with something, they've been trying to hide their true feelings, they've been trying to pretend that you know, this was stable, it was secure, when the fact of the matter is, is it isn't. And now they realize, yeah, there's regrets. But they're beginning to realize that there's a better opportunity and they focused on this hurt and this loss and this pain for too long. They focused on this false foundation, this... Uh, situation that was unstable and never built solid for a long time somebody is focused on that for a long time but it looks to me like I'm ready for the completion I'm ready for this to end this guy is looking at the completion I'm ready I'm ready to be on top of the world again, I'm ready. I'm ready to go find wish fulfillment because I've been obsessed and lost and stuck and in pain for too long. Somebody's taking back their power, there's no doubt. There's no doubt, they're seeing the light. Somebody is absolutely seeing the light. And walking away completely. I'm walking away from this emotional discontent. There's a breakup here. And I'm sorry. I know that people want to only hear the positive. There's a lot of people that are realistic and don't, though. Thank you, guys. Thank you to the rest of you. I get very few that, you know, are tender, but there's still a few. Anyway, um, this is walking away. I'm leaving it. I'm leaving those empty cups. I'm leaving that empty love situation. I'm leaving it. I'm leaving it behind. Seriously. This is, these are, these are both, okay. These three cards are breakup cards. They're all right together. It's done. And whether you've just broken up or you broke up a long time ago, there's no... You've put in the, the more effort than you should have, put it that way. You've stuck it out. You've held on. You did more than you, than you should have done. It's not real. It's not stable. It's not secure. And I think that somebody is realizing that that they have a better opportunity once they move on. Somebody is completing a big, huge cycle in their life, one phase, heading to someplace more bright. This person has a new vision, seriously. See the light? He's heading towards the light. Somebody is heading towards, you know, what's this, the, the infinity sign, right? Somebody's headed towards that ultimate wish fulfillment peace where they've been in a state of no peace. They've lost enough serenity and peace within themselves. They've reached that point of collapse. They have. 
They've avoided this for so long, but they're to the point where I just soon, I just soon walk away now. This person sees that they have an opportunity to begin again. They do. The world is the world is big. And this person is ready to take on the world. He's looking at, I'm ready to take this on. I'm ready to travel in a new direction. I'm ready, ready to go where I've never been before. Somebody has come to the realization that they are ready to move in a new direction where they have never been before. Okay? So somebody is definitely completing a cycle. There's no doubt. That world card is the biggest completion of them all. It's universally driven right under that star. It's like there's been no there's been no wish fulfillment here. There's been no, you know, satisfaction. And I've held on long enough. I've held on to this pain. Betrayed myself. I've done more than I more than I should have. It's too much of a false foundation. I accept the pain. I'm walking away. I got the world at my you know, below me, I, I got the world in, in my hands. Um, I, I'm taking the power back and I'm going to where I have never been before because there's more opportunity for me there. Somebody is finishing. It's, it's done. It's done. We've reached the finish line. It's over. It's over. There's no hope left. Goodbye. The Eight of Cups, goodbye. The time is now. Somebody is making the decision to move forward. Leaving. I'm leaving. Knight of Cups. Chariot moving quickly towards happiness to love. I'm taking action because I deserve love and I'm moving. I'm putting myself in the driver's seat. I'm facing the opposition. I'm facing my fears. I'm finding the mental strength. I'm moving. Goodbye. Same story. I know that this is what I need to do. Their intuition has driven them. The intu it's tri driven. Intuition has led them. Somebody knows, they know, and they think that this person has been gaining strength within, inner strength, inner power. Somebody has restrained themselves and went through some sort of spiritual awakening and received some sort of epiphany that it's time to let this go. It's time to let go of this pain. It's time to move on. It's time to head out. It's time to put myself in the driver's seat and take this, take the world in my hands. Somebody's traveling. Somebody's moving. They're literally traveling. This is like the chariot right next to the world. I'm traveling. Somebody's traveling to a new desti destination. And that could be literally like, this could be world travel. Could be international travel. Could be anywhere. But this is, this is some serious travel. It's like, whether it's spiritual travel, I don't know. This this could this is travel. Somebody is traveling. It could be. It could be. And maybe that's what happens. Some we we do we do do travel spiritually. It's like astral travel or whatever. Somebody has received some sort of higher knowledge with this high priestess. A higher knowledge. A higher intuition or a message or something that says you know it's time to move on it's time to go it is the eight of cups the chariot card the world card the five of cups uh, it's time to go completion of a difficult phase it's time to complete this this lesson this is the lesson master your emotions find the strength to face your fears Take the lead and put yourself back on top. Somebody is me is is dropping. 
This is the Ten of Wands reversed. I'm dropping this load. I'm dropping this burden. Somebody is making a conscious change to move on from something that was unsuccessful. Because they're looking for success. They're looking for happiness. They're looking for love. I'm looking for something more. And I'm sick of being stuck. Somebody's been stuck. Somebody's been stuck for a long time. Trapped. Trapped in their own mind. In limbo and suspension. But I think that somebody is about to face the struggle and face their fears and follow their heart. Somebody's heart is leading them down a new path and helping them to release something that was overwhelming them. An obsession. Their inner guide led the way. And they're walking away. And that's what I have. I, the only people that can change this energy is you. Right now, this is the collective. This is the year of massive change. This is exactly what is going on. Somebody is leaving behind a painful situation. Very painful. Very painful. It's been overwhelming. It's been burdensome. It's been unfulfilling. And they were obsessed with it for a really, and I mean obsessed. It wasn't, it's not, it's over, it's done. Somebody is finding the mental strength to release once and for all. Major completion here. Completion, completion, completion. It's over, it's done. There's, there's nothing left, there's nothing left. I done my part. And I accept the lesson. And that's what I have. Oh, we were going to get one of these. We were going to get one of these, weren't we? January 10th. It's the end of a difficult time because somebody has decided to go where they've never been. I'm, I'm heading in a new direction. I got a new vision. Somebody has regained their focus, regained their confidence and their strength. That's what's happened with the King of Wands here. I've regained my strength. I'm, I'm, I'm moving on from this. I'm goodbye. Goodbye. I've hung around and I've been obsessed with this and tried to pretend and hung on for too long. Somebody is no more. No more. Distant thunder. Clear the air. Perfect choice, eh? Distant thunder. Storm a brewing. Somebody's leaving anyway. It's all right. Somebody's leaving. Distant thunder. Clear the air. Dramatic. It even says dramatic. This is dramatic. It is. Dramatic purification, renewal, and healing are occurring on many levels. Don't be concerned if there is chaos in your life. In this instance, it is good. It is shaking things up so you don't become stagnant. If your auric field or your personal space is cluttered, it's difficult for exciting new experiences and opportunities to come into your life. And that's exactly what's going on here. It's time to clear out, release the old, discarded, and unused. Purify the dross out of your life. In order for renewal to occur, the old needs to make way for the new. And that's exactly what is going on here. Somebody is releasing something that they have been obsessed with once and for all to make way for a new relationship, the Knight of Cups. 
And because they do so, because they find the mental strength to do so, it's going to happen. There's going to be a new beginning. But I think today is the day of release. I've hung around long enough. I want love. It's time for me to let this go. That's it. Talk to you tomorrow.